The Philippine Technology Transfer Act of 2009 ushered in developments in UP in terms of intellectual property management. This gave birth to technology transfer and business development, otherwise known as the TTBDO, in the UP system in 2011. Today, this is an office under the Vice Chancellor for Research. Essentially, our office provides assistance to UP Manila faculty, students, and researchers in the protection of their intellectual outputs and eventually scaling this up in order to reach their beneficiaries in this country and beyond. I'm uh, Dr. Leo Kubilian. I'm an ophthalmologist and uh, my specialty is on cornea, eye infections and inflammation. My invention is, is the development of this uh, anti-infective eye drops. It can be used as uh, an initial treatment for uh, eye diseases uh, that related to infection. For me, uh, uh, creativity is, is like a thinking process. If there are things that are not available and we channel our thinking to create ideas, and convert it into a reality. I am Dr. Cecil Maramba Lazarte. I am the director of the Institute of Herbal Medicine of the National Institutes of Health in UP Manila. I am also a second generation arbolario, a second generation professor and pediatrician. So the near prop as a group has invented the Lagundi tablet and syrup, which is an herbal medicine clinically validated and its indication is for cough of non-bacterial origin and for asthma. What is creativity is being able to find unique ways of uh, solving problems. In that sense, I would call myself creative. When you say Filipino creativity, it's using what we have here in the Philippines, our own natural resources, uh, in order to solve our own problems. In that way, be self-reliant. I'm Edward Wang, and I'm a consultant orthopedic surgeon at the uh, UP College of Medicine and the Philippine General Hospital. The invention that you are interested in is called the Sanipad. Now, I won't call that my invention. We have a big team and it's an innovation which is really a self-contained disinfecting cubicle called the Sanipad. So it's a sanitation pod, so Sanipad. Everyone was involved, every single aspect so that it's safe for the consumer. I'm a professor of uh, anatomy from the UP College of Medicine. My name is uh, Dr. Rafael Bundo. Okay, so I have been teaching in the college for the longest time, something like 35 years. And I'm also an orthopedic surgeon by uh, specialty. And my subspecialization is uh, spine surgery. So most of the instruments that we have were designed by the industries. They're just an adaptation of what it was before when it was being used for open surgery, now being used for minimally invasive surgery. And this is my invention, the ergonomic rondure or the ergonomic surgical rondure, which is an offshoot of the problems that arose because of its ill design, because it was designed by the industry and not by the doctors. Our mandate is encapsulated in your catchphrase, sick, secure, and scale to serve, which also provides a concise idea of the innovation process, moving from intellectual property audit, protection, and eventually technology transfer. We stimulate the proactive disclosure of the research outputs and creative works in the university through intellectual property campaigns, 
Technology Intellectual Property Audit, Intellectual Property Advisory Services, and Disclosure Portal. We secure, we deliver operative and decisive technology assessments towards the realization of relevant intellectual property protection. We provide copyright registration, trademark protection, utility model protection, industrial design protection, and patent protection. Meanwhile, we scale to serve. We catalyze technology deployment for the public good while balancing the advancement and sustainability of a culture of innovation in the university. We offer services such as business development, technology licensing, intellectual property valuation, license management, freedom to operate, request to use trademark, and technology awareness campaign. As a young office, the University of the Philippines Manila Technology Transfer and Business Development Office is consistently looking for partners to increase capacities in the university and speed up the process of moving technologies from the bench to the community. One of the earliest initiatives of the office was to partner with the Department of Science and Technology, Technology Application and Promotion Institute for an intellectual property audit and subsequent protection through patents or utility models. TDPDO is driven by its passion for assisting clients and stakeholders. We are committed to promote health science and technology and to serve as a catalyst for positive change, market value creation, and entrepreneurial thinking for the benefit of Filipino consumers and the local industries. In this light, we encourage you all to join us in our efforts to advance health innovations towards nation building and economic development.